Online, a Monroe church is giving back to the community this Thanksgiving and donating 100 boxes of food to those in need. Fox 14's Hunter Elise is back from Berean Baptist Church with more on why the church decided to start an event like this for Thanksgiving. Hunter? Sarah, this is the first year Berean Baptist Church donated meals to families. They say the goal is to be an active church in the south side of Monroe and help others be thankful this holiday season. Having a real Thanksgiving meal on Thanksgiving is pretty common, but not everyone can afford to have it. Berean Baptist Church in Monroe is changing that. This is the first year the church is giving out food boxes, but the dream has been with the church for a few years. We understand that around this time a lot of people are going through uh, economically not sound at this present moment and we want to be able to give during Thanksgiving to make sure that people in our community have something to eat and you know have something to celebrate. This year they're giving away 100 boxes of food for people in the community. Boxes include a turkey or whole chicken, cake mix, canned vegetables and a few extra items. Families from around the area went to the church Monday night to receive the boxes. Me and my family really appreciate Berean Baptist for allowing us to be able to share this special occasion uh, because times have been hard and it's just like simply amazing for them to be able to, you know, give back and everything. I really appreciate it. Each box feeds about five people, which means in the end, the church will feed about 500 people this Thanksgiving. Bishop Looney says there's only one thing he hopes the boxes accomplish. We were able to help spread a little joy through this holiday season. Those who received a box say they're excited to be able to have a real Thanksgiving meal with their entire family. It's definitely needed this year. I'm very, very thankful. The elders at the church hope to have more events like this in the future and plan to continue this Thanksgiving event in years to come. In the studio, Hunter Lee, Fox 14 News.